driving to Preston, Idaho, and most of you are probably wondering why um, it's not a known place. But that is because that town is where Napoleon Dynamite was filmed. I have a weird obsession with going to places where movies are filmed for some reason. And I'm very, very excited to go there. So if you've never seen Napoleon Dynamite, I'm going to ask you to please exit this video and go watch it right now. And if you have, then be prepared for me to start fangirling when we arrive. I am very excited and um, see you when we're there. We're here and I'm freaking out because this is the school and it's really cool. Um. Napoleon and Deb, why uh, they used to sit right there. Oh. This is Preston High School, home of the Indians apparently. Oh my gosh, I'm shook. Okay, so we're downtown Preston and we had just gone to Pedro's house and I forgot to take a video because I'm not smart. But now we're going into this little store that is all like Napoleon Dynamite stuff and I think it's gonna have a map of all the places. Cause we're trying to go to Napoleon's house and we drove and it was not right and it's really loud and I'm sorry. But yeah, we'll get there. So we're at the store. This is the map of all the Napoleon Dynamite like places in Preston. And then there's two in Franklin, Idaho, but we're not gonna go to those. So yeah. This is hilarious. There's so many of these, they're really funny. Don't be jealous, but I've been chatting online with babes all day. <laughs> All of Deb's bracelets. And the shirts, of course. Okay, so we just bought some merch because we're those type of people. And now we're going to walk down the block to the thrift store where he bought his brown suit, which I'm super excited about. And we're gonna walk past the cut and corral where he referred to getting his hair cut. They actually just sold it. And it's super interesting because the lady who works here, um, her son was actually in the movie. He was the sound person which is super cool. Um, but yeah, he was the sound guy and he's in the movie. And apparently the movie, um, a lot of the people that live in Preston helped in the movie and like weren't paid, but they were in the movie. So that's super cool. So this is the place that Napoleon refers to when he to um, asks, or Deb asks him, asks him for a haircut or something. All right, so this is Desert Industries where Napoleon goes in and buys his brown suit. So we're gonna go inside. Okay, so we're driving and we're trying to find Napoleon's house. And of course, the time that we come, his road has construction going on on it. And we have to go straight, but we can't go straight because the road is closed. So now we're trying to go down a different road and try to make it back to the 800 North Road. Right I don't here, know. Maybe. Okay, after a really confusing time, we made it. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Where's Napoleon? Where's Tina? Oh, and there's even a sign up there that says it's his house. Heck yeah, Napoleon Dynamite house. So now we're at the elementary school where they played tetherball. Um, we're trying to find it. I really, oh my gosh, I think I see it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I see it. Oh. Mom, this is where like they played basketball, I'm pretty sure, during the PE scene. I think they played right where that, oh my god, there's the tetherball pole. Oh. I don't know if you can see that pole right there. It's right there. That's where they play, and Napoleon tells Deb that he caught her a delicious bass. And it's really funny, and oh my gosh, I'm dying. Life is literally complete. This is the pole that they played at where they high five, same string, probably touched it. Okay, I touched it. We both touched it. This is amazing. How do you feel, Mom? <laughs> okay, so I think we went to all the places that we're gonna that we were gonna go to. Um, if I didn't take videos, I'll insert pictures. I didn't take video at Pedro's house. I just forgot, so I'll put in a picture of that. But 
Um, Trisha's house and Summer's house are also here, but we're not gonna go to those because they're not very relevant. Um, we did drive by the dojo, but it's no longer a dojo anymore. It's actually for sale, I think, but it had the same roofing and stuff. And yeah, it was super fun, but also um, their streets here are very confusing, very hard to get to the places. And of course, the time that we come, Napoleon's house road is construction. But yeah, it was really fun. Sorry, broke that a lot. Now that I'm editing this video in the car right after we just left, I realized that was probably one of the best experiences of my life. Um, I know that's sad, but it was. I really want to go back there and film scenes from the movie. That I think that would be really fun. Also, shout out to my mom for dealing with me and taking me there. It's kind of out of the way. But yeah, um, that was really, really fun. Now we're in the car again for six more hours. Oh, fun. Five more hours. Um, 